Hi. Hi. How are you? We have met before, right? We have met so familiar. many times. Yeah. Hi. How are you guys? Good to see you. Good to see you again. Good to see you too. I like feel like I watch you guys grow up. Uh, oh, no. <laughs> yeah. How are yeah. We doing? Pretty much. Are we doing yeah. Okay, so I have to ask you guys first of all, what can we expect now from the new season? Oh, oh my God, all kinds of. Well, it's. We're not in high school anymore on the show, um, but it still has all the same drama and the same, you know, love and loss and friend drama and all the stuff that that you're used to seeing. I think um, there's surprises. There's like who's dating who surprises. Yeah, Jake is dating someone from the past. Yes. Tamara and Sadie may be best friends. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. There's of course there's all the Maddie Jenna stuff that everyone's always right. used to. Are they together? Not together? <laughs> blah blah blah. I mean, there was a baby in the trailer. Maddie was like holding a baby. <laughs> Maybe a mini McKibben. Maybe. You have to uh, find out. Yeah, no, it's Maybe uh, Eva really was pregnant. <laughs> Maybe. Hey, you never know. Yeah. And I talked to your producer as well, Chris, and he says that a lot of the things on the show are inspired by his life, the writer's life, but also the actor's life. Is there any episodes that you can relate to or remember that has happened to you guys? Man, I well, oh, go, go ahead. No, you oh, uh, well, uh, I think for for me, um, when Mike and Chris came on, they made Jake a singer all of a sudden, and that was like my life in high school was musical theater and talent shows and uh, being a performer and things like that. So it was really fun to explore that and uh, cool that they integrated that, even though I had no idea they were doing it and they didn't know that I sang and stuff in high school. They like called, they're like, "Do you sing?" I'm like, "Yes," and that's exactly what I want to do. So uh, yeah, that was fun. Um, well. I think that they probably threw us a bone, Jillian and I, because we are such good friends to make Tamara and Sadie good friends on yeah. the show. And um, also, Sadie went to college in New York, and I grew up in New York, so it was. Yeah. Plus, like all, I mean, aspects of our character, you know, right. going from season one all the way through, like all that kind of stuff. So, and awkward has become so big. I like every time we go to the movie awards and stuff like that, I can hear people screaming at you when you walk by. Have you? Do you have any fun fan stories? Because I, I bet you guys get approached a lot now. I, I'm, yeah, well, yeah, uh, we get recognized a lot, which is so much fun. I, it's, it's. It's a blast. I love interacting with the fans, and um, they're rabid for the show. They love it so much. They they throw out things that I've forgotten that's even happened on the show. They love it so much. Um, I think one of my favorite interactions ever was I was in uh, Europe, just on a vacation, and I was in Italy, and like standing at the Trevi Fountain, like I'd never been there. I'm marveling at this thing and not thinking about the show at all. And these I got recognized, and they want to take selfies, and here we are by this monument, and it, we're overseas. It was just it, that's when I kind of realize like wow we're on something that people watch <laughs> yeah. Yeah, any uh, well my favorite thing is when people come up to me and say the wrong catchphrase because you know it's like you're welcome and they come up and they're like thank you and I'm like okay <laughs> or they're like don't worry about it I'm like where did you get that so that's but also to go off your story when we were I mean, we both love Stay by the Bell, and we were on a flight together, and Tiffany Beeson was on it, Kelly Kapowski, and people were asking for our pictures, and we were looked at each other, and we're like, wow. We're like, wow. Kelly Kapowski is here, and people want our pictures. That was pretty cool. It was cool. I believe that you guys get this question a lot, but do you remember your most awkward moment? Like, in life? Yeah. Works so oh. hard to forget it. Yeah. <laughs> man, I've had so many. Um, man, there's so many. To, you, the thing is with me though, I, I think in being an actor, there's something to this too. Like we we are so used to making fools of ourselves all the time that like if I trip or have something hanging out of my nose or whatever, like I don't, I just kind of wipe it off and go about my day. So I don't really remember them. I can't really recall them as easily. What about you? I mean, I feel like I'm, I, I'm, I don't know. I guess there's, I wear a lot of short skirts on the show. I, there's a scene in season, oh, this episode two, season one, where my Sadie's skirt is tucked into her underwear, and that actually happened to me <laughs> um, out on the pep rally field. Yeah. So I was like, of course. <laughs> I, I think that has happened to a lot of girls. Yeah. Me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> happened to me the other day. I was at an audition. We were all waiting there for so long, so we all just started talking to each other, and then I got up to go in, and they were like, Molly, Molly. And I was like, this is a good group of girls. <laughs> well, we're so excited. 
I, I actually had done it on purpose. I was trying to get the job, but no, I'm just kidding. That's the thing with act, when you're an actor, you can always say that. I just do it on purpose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. yeah. Well, we're so excited to see what comes up next. Thank, Thank you so much, much you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Nice to see you again. Good to see you. Thank you. Thank you.